Okay guys, so we've come to the end of the dressage at Burley. I think it's been very interesting, hasn't it? Really, really interesting. And of course, Pippa Funnel showing us all how it's done, schooling yeah, us all. It's not unheard of for her to be in the lead. No, very uh, true. On a 22, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. I did. I managed to do a 44.5. Yeah, but lots of lovely bits in the lots test. Lots of really nice bits. I was really, really pleased with him. Yeah. Like, uh, but flying changes are just, they're not on our radar at the moment, <laughs> but um, they're coming, so. You smiled we... the whole way through though, you dazzled them with your teeth. Yeah, something like that. But yeah, no, he, he, was, he was good and I was really pleased with him, so yeah. it's cool. And, but, um, and then we've got Oliver in second, yeah. um, and then I don't know how annoyed Izzy will be with that, because her boyfriend and girlfriend. So, yes, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Be a bit, bit of rivalry across, there, yeah. yes. But I think she's done really well as a young horse, that spring power. So. Really, really well. And I know she was talking about how badminton blew its brain a little bit. And actually she had to go away and really, really work on it to calm it down. And it's come here and produced a gorgeous, gorgeous test. Yeah, because I remember um, seeing it at Blenheim as a young young horse. Yeah. And it was quite hot. So she's done, obviously done a really good job. Yeah, 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 yeah. And Gemma's in there. Gemma's yeah. in there, um, yeah. which is great to see her back up there with a lovely, lovely dressage horse and obviously out on Arctic Soul tomorrow morning, which I'm sure you'll be watching. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah he'd be a good one to watch. Yeah. Um, and uh, and then Piggy's up there as well. And yeah. um, Piggy was amazing today with me. She she helps me on the flat and yeah. I was obviously back an hour and a bit before her and she she said, oh, um, I'm not gonna be able to help you um, tomorrow. So she gave me my pep talk yesterday yeah. <laughs> and I was doing my warm up and then I saw her like this, like a uh, vision in front of me, she suddenly <laughs> turned up and it was amazing and she was so helpful and brilliant and it was literally just before she was going to do mm. hers. So I'm, I'm so pleased that she's done well because she deserves it. She's yeah. such a nice person. What advice was she giving you yesterday? Uh, sit up, chin up, <laughs> uh, don't fiddle too much, yeah. um, ride him, hold his hand, look after yeah. him. You know, because that's one of the things with, with here is, or any any big event or any event really, yeah. you do all your warm up and very often you come in and you go, right, do it. I've, yeah. I've prepped you, so just do it. And as she was saying, you know, you can't do that. You've got to go in there and be like, no, I'm still with you and I'm still holding your hand and still looking after you. Yeah. And that was the main thing she said to me as I was about to go in. Yeah. So hold his hand, keep your chin up and have a nice time. Basically. Wise words from a great. Yeah. So do you reckon you'll be more nervous tomorrow morning than you were at badminton on the other horse? Uh, I think it's all relative. Yeah. I think so like at badminton, um, the horse did a nice test. He's very capable of jumping double clear. He's experienced at the level. Mm -hmm. um, and he's very capable of being fast as well. Mm -hmm. So there was kind of a little bit of pressure in there to yeah. go well. Uh, whereas tomorrow is a completely different ball game for me. This horse is really inexperienced. Yeah. This is like a stepping stone yeah. for him. I want to see how he's going to cope with it all. Yeah. Um, he but equally, a he's a brilliant jumper, yeah. but equally, it's a massive step up yeah. and the crowds are so much heavier and the fences are so much more difficult. Yeah. So it's just, yeah, I I love taking them to the next level. Yeah. It's a bit like taking your pre-novice horse novice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah sorry, yeah. 100 horse novice yes. and then your novice horse intermediate. Yes. It's always the same. Yeah, I always yeah, think it's the yeah. same kind are of buzz. Are they ready? Are they not? And yeah, then and it's the same. challenge out there. Yeah, and yeah. it's the same. It's like I say, it's all relative. So um, yeah. I'm excited to see how he goes because he's a yeah. really nice horse. But is the atmosphere normally different on a Burley morning as opposed to a badminton morning? No, it's all very similar. Yeah. It is all, and everyone's kind of in it together, and yeah, yeah we all we all chat through the fences, and it's everyone yeah. against the fences, yeah. and then it's kind of like what's the result at the end of the day, a little yeah. bit more than anything, yeah, which is quite cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's, yeah. it's like a bit of a family atmosphere. Yes, and in the lorry park, who are you with? Who 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 are you park next to? Uh, who am I park next to? Um, I've got Will Furlong straight ahead of me. It's yeah. quite nice because it's all nicely spread out, which is yeah. really good. Yeah, oh, you've got lots um, of space then. Yeah, I did. I had I, I had Michael Young park next to me a couple of years ago, and that was quite intimidating. <laughs> yeah, I can but imagine. then I also followed him in the dressage <laughs> once as well, and that was really intimidating. Yeah, runs the lorry saying, "Come on, give me tips, give me yeah. tips." <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and and tomorrow cool. we've said about watching Arctic Soul. Any others you're going to try and catch in the morning? <laughs> yeah, uh, I'd really like to watch Ballamore Class, but unfortunately yeah. <laughs> he's, he's at last to go, isn't he? Um, I, I, I just want to watch quite a few at the beginning, not a loads, but a few at the beginning and get a bit of an idea of how it's all riding. Yeah. Um, some how some distances are coming up or not coming up. Yeah. And um, and see how it's going. And then I don't like I don't like to be influenced too much by yeah. what other people are doing. Yeah. Because um, the best I've ever ridden here was when I was 30 to go, so I couldn't watch any yeah. which is a good thing. <laughs> it's going to be a really, really exciting day tomorrow. Yeah, so it's really exciting. Looking forward to cross country. Keep up to date with us. You can check everything out on, the, on our Facebook and Instagram. Keep up to date with what's going on.